I'm Louise Lincoln. I'm the director of the Art Museum at DePaul University. This group of works is really interesting because it's made in one of the most difficult times in American history. And the prints in this show are like a window into the 1930s, which was a time of real economic hardship and struggle. When the stock market collapsed in 1929, lots and lots of people were out of work, and the federal government set up a lot of programs to provide jobs for people. And interestingly, they included artists, paid them to produce works of art, and many of the works they produced were about the moment and the time and the place. When the WPA was set up in 1934, Franklin Roosevelt wanted to use the arts as a way to help people identify themselves as Americans and having a project in common to get through the Depression and back to prosperity. And he quite deliberately encouraged the WPA to promote art that celebrated workers, celebrated the nation as a whole, and celebrated a certain kind of history and politics. This exhibition is drawn out of a new addition to DePaul's art collection, 100 prints from the 1930s, from the collection of Belvard and Marion Needles, longtime supporters of the museum. One of the things that the WPA artists turned to again and again was the role of the worker. And remember, this is a time when everybody is thinking about what it means to be employed. And so the print of the workers polishing the propeller, for example, it's a great big propeller for a steamship. They're shown as strong and confident and really masterful. Another print that I think is really telling is one of a factory at full production with smokestacks pouring out this black smoke. And we tend to look at that print and think, Oh, look at all that pollution. And in the moment, I think it was much more likely read as, look at that, full production, a lot of jobs, that's a beautiful sight. More smoke, more smokestacks, the more the better. This exhibition is really a very detailed window into what people's lives were like in a time of real hardship. And I think we tend to think of the Depression as a long time ago and far away in our experience. And some of these images really bring it home. It's hard not to see this material and think about what people's lives were like in that time. Mm -hmm.